I'm going to level with you guys. I'm going to keep it real here. I uh, wear hearing aids in both ears. Not exactly street legal. Keep that on the DL. Uh, that doesn't mean anything. Uh, I do wear hearing aids, but I don't want any pity. No sympathy. I love my hearing aids. In fact, you guys should be jealous because I take my hearing aids out to sleep. I sleep like a baby. Oh, man. I don't hear a thing. I wake up feeling so refreshed. It's amazing. It really makes you wonder who has the disability. It does. It really does. No, it's me. I have the disability for sure. Absolutely. Since I take my hearing aids out to sleep, I don't use the same alarm clock you guys use. I use a vibrating alarm clock. I put it under my pillow and it vibrates so powerfully. It's amazing. It's a lifesaver. I love it. But it's also terrifying. So scary. Because all my dreams end in an earthquake. And my hearing aids aren't waterproof, which is ridiculous. So I have to take them out when I'm taking a shower or when I go swimming. So, you know, pool parties are a nightmare. I'm not very good at the game Marco Polo. That's not my game. Not a whole lot of polo happening when I'm playing that game. Lots of Marco. But, uh... When I first started doing comedy, I didn't even want to do any jokes about my hearing aids. I didn't want to be the hearing aid guy. You know, I was, I was watching this interview with a really famous comedian, and he talked about how he became famous for doing a certain type of joke. And when he tried to do other stuff, people didn't want to hear it because they pigeonholed him. And as soon as I heard that, I was like, you know what? I'm not doing any jokes about my hearing aids. Ain't nobody putting this guy in a box. That's what I said, and I meant it. And then uh, a couple minutes later in the same interview, he talked about how he made $20 million last year. <laughs> That changed my perspective quite a bit. <laughs> I remember when I heard that part, I screamed so loud my hearing aids broke. Because I wear hearing aids. I have a disability. <laughs> I'm the hearing aid guy. I assume you guys are laughing. I can't hear. I'm really deaf. Um, anyways, guys, uh, I wear hearing aids and... Um, Come on, that $20 million, are you kidding me? I'm not leaving that kind of money on the table. Honestly, for $20 million, I'd go full Helen Keller. Full Helen Keller. <laughs> I'm after that Helen Keller money, baby. Oh man, could you imagine? Full Helen Keller, 20 mil? Oh man, I'd buy myself a yacht. I'd be out on the open water, just taking in all the beautiful smells. <laughs> me, and, uh, me and my partner broke up recently and uh, oh, got, got really quiet in here. <laughs> or did it? <laughs> no, I heard that. It did. I, I, I wear hearing aids, yeah, in both ears. But uh, I know why it got quiet. It got quiet because I said partner, right? And as soon as, that, as, soon as somebody says partner, and you don't know them well, you can't even focus on the rest of the conversation. You're just, you're just trying to solve the mystery. Like, hmm. Partner, huh? I don't care either way, man. I just need to know. You're all looking at me trying to crack the case right now. Well, he's kind of got that list, but that could be the hearing impairment. I don't know. What this could be that to? No, me and my girlfriend broke up to clear up that mystery. Because um, I realized I was gay. Um, thank you very much, guys. I'm the hearing aid guy.